Hi there. Now in an earlier video I showed you that the area of a triangle was given by this formula a half AB sine C. Useful when you knew two sides and the included angle. Now I didn't give you a proof, I just asked you to accept this. Now in this video what I want to do is show you the proof of this. Now normally when we find the area of a triangle we take the base which say for this triangle here is A little a and we know the height let's just mark it in here h we'll call it okay that'll be our height so when it comes to working out the area of the triangle abc let's just put an intro here area of triangle abc we would normally say well okay it's half the base base being a from c to b here times the perpendicular height h but if I consider a right angle triangle drawn in here, it's just to complete it there, here's our right angle, then by basic trigonometry, using this angle here, C, okay, we can say that, I'll just put but here, that the sine of angle C equals the opposite side, which is 8, divided by the hypotenuse, which is B. So the sine of C equals H divided by B. And from this, if we rearrange this, making H the subject, it follows that H would be equal to B times the sine of angle C. So what we've got is that the area of the triangle, ABC, is equal to half the base, that's half A again, but instead of H, we can write B sine C, half AB sine C, which is what we had to prove. So there's our proof then. Okay?